My story is um, last December, my mother called and told me I needed to get this book. And it was called Breaking the Habit of Being Yourself. And Dad said it was the greatest thing yet. And so I went right down that day and bought it and got excited about it. And uh, I thought, wow, this is amazing. I, I finally got the mechanics here. And I started doing the meditation. And uh, I, in uh, the end of January, things kind of fell apart for me. I had, uh, I was working on getting my company off the ground and I lost my condo in Boulder, which I was keeping down there. And then as I was moving out, my little Maltese that I've had for about five years now had, uh, she fell out the window and broke her paw completely, you know, all four bones there. The cast was on for uh, 12 weeks and when we went in you know I was so excited the day you know we get to go get this cast off and and uh, her leg was we looked at it and the vet said we need to amputate the whole leg and I said man this is not this is not gonna work it's unacceptable well I was kinda living in my van and sleeping on my friends couches and to keep my sanity I was I'd get up at three four o'clock in the morning and I would do my meditation for an hour plus. I do it every day, and that's what really, you know, kept my kept me going. And uh, anyway, the vet decided to. Uh, he said we want to take the leg off, and I said that's unacceptable. So I said I want a second opinion. I took it up to the uh, university hospital in Fort Collins, and they had three doctors look at it up there. In fact, their top uh, orthopedics or whatever she was for animals, and. They said the same thing. They said we need to amputate, and I'm going. And they had me set up with the prosthetics guy and the whole thing. And I'm going. They, I just didn't see it, and so I said, "Wow!" And I got on the email, and I sent emails out to a bunch of my friends around the world that understand quantum physics, and I said, "Okay, tomorrow morning at 7:30, you know, Tuesday morning, we're going to do a healing for Leilani." I said, "Let's all just please envision her running." you know, through the grass like she loves to do. And we did. On a Wednesday, I took her up to, no, it was Thursday morning, I took her up to the university hospital again. They took the the uh, bandages off and they're sitting there and the gal's kind of like, uh, well, the, the leg was completely, it was back to normal. It was pink, fleshy, the pads were connected. Um, and the only thing was uh, some of the bones on this side had completely dissolved into the body. And they said, well, we need to take the foot off. And I'm going, no, I don't think so. <laughs> so anyway, we had healed it. And to make a long story short again, um, I worked with another vet over at my parents' place. Um, she is, I, I just, last Monday, got to see the x-rays. The bone is where there was no bone, it grew back. The leg is healthy, it's covered with hair. Um, she's running around like you'd never know anything had happened. And it was it was just um, the most amazing thing. And I would do the meditation and put her in my field. And I knew that if Joe was able to heal himself, there's no reason why I couldn't heal my dog. And then my company that I've been working on for 10 years, um, I got a call out of the blue and this woman asked me um, how much I needed for the university research. And I told her, and she funded the complete university research uh, for our product. Um, it's, it's just, it's amazing. And, and uh, that happened. And then I get another call because I'm in the meditation. It says, okay, now you get to choose a future event. See it the way you want to see it. And so every morning I'm, I'm seeing myself signing a contract with these guys or doing this or that. And I got a, um, a call from a friend of mine and he said, you need to come to Vegas. And uh, I've got somebody I want you to meet. They're interested in funding your company. It turns out it's one of the largest investment companies on the planet. And I mean, this just all started happening. And then while I'm out there, I'm going, well, this is pretty cool. And I've been doing the two meditations, the, the rising water and the body parts. And I just started doing the blessing the energy centers. 
And so I'm, I'm sitting there, I go, well, you know, I'm going to play with this. So like in the movie The Matrix where those green numbers are coming down, I had dollar signs dropping. So I go out and I said, well, I'm going to try this. So I went to uh, one of the restaurants there that had a slot machine or the, the poker thing. I started playing with quarters. Boom. I hit a royal flush. <laughs> I'd never hit one in my life. And then I've got within one day, I hit that one. Then I changed to dollars because I'd made $1,000. I hit another one. And then I hit six four of a kinds. One of them was four deuces, which pays a thousand dollars. And I'm going. First thing I did was, I called the hotel, reserved my stuff for Joe's, you know, deal in Denver, <laughs> and 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 paid for my thing. And I said, this is just, I love this stuff. It's amazing how it works. And now that I've just finished, you know, four days here with Joe, I I looked in the mirror last night, and that guy that I was looking at. It's like a, it's a new me. Um, I I didn't, I almost had, had to take a second look. I said, wow, I said, hey, how are you doing, man? I'm so excited because we get to go out and, and we get to live it now. And it's awesome.